not your average tattoo shop. And Eric Catalano is not your average tattoo artist. Sure, I'm getting a little tattoo work done right now, but it's Eric's more unique work that's literally changing lives. The police say somebody was shopping here at the Schnooks in South County. That's when somebody tried to walk up and steal their car in broad daylight. Yeah, I did, Mike. In Missouri alone, there are more than 900 bridges that are in, quote, poor condition, just like this one here. Now, the governor's got a plan to fix about 250 of them, but most of us want to know what the permanent fix is. $50,000, that's the average salary of a federal employee. Two paychecks of that annual pay would be $3,846. Compare that to the $2,328 of 17 days pay, the next longest government shutdown, and you have a difference of $1,517. And the longer this shutdown goes on, the more people will struggle. First, this video showing what appears to be a toddler fight club. Then, this video of a child care worker tossing a little girl across the room. Now, Governor Mike Parson is responding, saying that one of the fundamental roles of government is to protect our children. It's something that for most of us would be unimaginable, taking a defenseless animal and dumping it on the side of the road. Things were a real mess at the Castle Park Apartments on Friday. You can see the wet stairs here. That's from cleaning up all the water damage after the pipes burst around 3 o'clock in the morning. Things are a real mess here at the Castle Park Apartments where the pipes burst early Friday morning. People who live here actually tell me they woke up to water dripping right on their face. There's a lot of rubbernecking going on from people driving by St. Andrews Plaza here in St. Charles, and it's all got to do with this sign simply reading, Warning, large wild cat seen eating mid-sized animal in backyard. Watch children and pets. I'm pretty sure Mother Nature has lost her mind here in Brentwood. It says the city of warmth right when you come into town, but the water in their fountain, I'm pretty sure, ran away from the Midwest. Here on my Five on Your Side weather app, it says it's negative 10 degrees outside. My camera battery has already dropped 20% and I've only been outside the car for about 10 minutes. Now people like Shannon can take advantage of everything from cooking equipment to laptops thanks to the Veterans Small Business Enhancement Act. Police say when they got to the home here on Olive Street, they found Preston's mother lying on the kitchen floor and Preston shot multiple times, apparently by his father. Festus police tell me they took the father into custody, but he's since been released while the prosecutor's office figures out whether or not to file charges. The sign out front says now enrolling, but when you step up to St. James the Greater School, you'll see the doors are closed for good. Leaving behind a lot of work over the past couple years trying to keep the school open and a lot of memories made behind the walls since the 60s.